Hey, welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm gonna talk about top 5 best tactical flashlight. Starting at number 5. Thrunite TC12. If simple, affordable, and bright are your three top priorities, then the Thrunite A Euro ATC12 might be a good pick. At only $45 it offers good output specs and includes a built-in USB charge circuit. The output is impressive, though the tint is greenish-blue and uneven across the beam even if you pick the A Euro e neutral YT A Euro option. The modes on this light Dona Euro trademark T give you any real perks, though. A tail click turns the light on at whatever mode you used last, and the side switch cycles through moonlight, low, medium, high and maximum output. Holding down the side button when the light is on gives you strobe, so at least you want a Euro trademark T trigger that accidentally. Coming at number 4. Streamlight Protac HL USB. The Streamlight A Euro 88054 Protac HL USB comes from one of the top players in tactical flashlights. With a legacy of reliable but affordable duty lights and weapon lights going back to the 1970s. Streamlight has kept up with the times, bringing reliable, bright LED emitters to their lineup and now offering USB charging internally. The two factors that slip the Streamlight lower in our ranking are a higher price and a low output mode Theta Euro. Trademark S bright enough to kill your night adapted vision. The low, high and strobe modes are easy to use and functional, but if it were in a Euro trademark T for the USB charging this light would in a Euro trademark T have made our list. A nice touch is that the charging port cover is a sleeve that slides up and down the barrel rather than a delicate little rubber insert your euro. Trademark LL break after a few months. At number 3. Lumentop FW3A. The Lumentop A Euro. FW3A is a community project that came together because of two key players on the flashlight discussion boards. A machinist whose username is Fritz15 and a programmer known as Toykeeper. Lumentop put together a light based on Fritz15 a Euro trademark S design. And we have the geekiest light that can still qualify for tactical use. The interface gives you moonlight mode slowly ramping up toward higher levels if you hold down the non-clicky tail switch or instant access to maximum output with a double tap. Using other modes pretty much requires you to carry around the manual with the light, but those two functions are very easy to use once you learn them. Number 2 of my list. 4 Sevens, Quark QK16 Elm Key. If you want the best small tactical flashlight, you a Euro trademark D expect some compromises to get a pocketable size. Well, Jason Hui took that problem and threw all his years of design experience at it to bring us the nearly perfect Quark A Euro, QK16 LMK3. Jason has made a name for himself with the amazing Prometheus custom-made flashlights, but in 2018 he bought the floundering 4.7s company to bring his expertise to the masses. This light has premium features in all the right ways. The color-accurate Nikia emitter is focused by a carefully designed reflector that gives an ideal balance of a bright center, spot and even fall-off coverage for mid-range visibility out to a few hundred feet. On the best mode the first click gives you a one lumen moonlight mode, and a double click gives you maximum output of about 700 lumens. This is about as good as a flashlight user interface can get with one button. And number one. Claris XT11 GT, the Claris A Euro. XT11 GT won our selection for best affordable tactical flashlight by cranking up the maximum output to 2000 lumens and giving us instant access to the most useful modes. They're a Euro trademark S even a USB charging circuit. So eat a Euro trademark S easy to keep this light ready for whatever situation comes your way. This is all included in a light that sells for less than $70. Just a few years ago some of these features could a Euro trademark TP had for any price. The killer feature here is a dual button tail switch. The big center switch always gives you maximum 2000 lumen output, but there a Euro trademark SA secondary paddle switch that can be programmed to activate a disorienting strobe light in a Euro a tactical a Euro modes. Or it can start the light at a 10 lumen low level for a Euro E outdoor C Euro use. The side switch lets you change to middle output levels and switch between programmed modes, 
but you can disable that altogether by holding it for 5 seconds, or disconnect the battery for storage by unscrewing the tail cap slightly. Check out this video description for latest price and more informations. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe and stay tuned.